Hi, you are on Proxy Seller channel, my name is Max and in this video I will tell you how to step by step set up a proxy in Ghost Browser, so you can anonymously work online from several accounts at the same time and safely do any actions on various resources, without fear of blocking or problems with administrators. At the beginning you need to install Ghost Browser, to do this you can use official website ghostbrowser.com. In download section select browser version, that's YouTube, download and install browser. When it's done open Ghost Browser. In the upper right corner of your browser find Ghost Proxy Control icon and click on it. Then click Add Edit Proxies. This is required in order to add your proxy. In the Proxy Control panel look for Add Bulk Proxies tab and click on it. In the window that opens select Export Sample Files. Below, in the same window, there is an explanation how to enter proxy address correctly into the file for proxy, which was automatically downloaded on your computer when you clicked on export sample files. At the bottom of Ghost Browser you can see this file. Let me clarify important point. Yes, it is described in the browser instruction, but I will say it again so that you won't have any difficulties. The file you downloaded has CSV extension. This extension should remain. Do not change it or save it with XLS or XLSC extension. Now open file. Here as you can see it is empty. Above is written how you need to enter proxy. Custom name is the name of your proxy. You can specify at your discretion and if you do not have one then do not specify anything. Start immediately with IP and Ghost Browser will give each proxy a sequence number. Specify IP and port separated by commas, login comma, password comma and so on. If you have notes about this proxy you can specify. Let's say binding by location or country, if not leave the field blank. If you do not have username and password for your proxy, then also do not specify anything, but commas should remain. Let's say you have proxy with username and password but without name or notes. Then enter IP, comma, port, comma, login, comma, password, comma, and that's all. In each line you can enter new proxy address, as much as you need for your work. After that we save this file and return to the Ghost Browser. Now you need to import this file from proxy into your browser. To do this click on import proxy list and select this file in the window that opens. Done. Ghost Browser has added your proxy and you can see them in proxy list. Next you need to test the specified proxy. To do this go to test proxies tab. You need to specify address of that site for which you want to use proxy and in which you need to use several accounts simultaneously. Once you have specified the address click test. In the window that opens at the top information about your proxy will appear in context of this site. This test will show how many of those proxies you have specified are not suitable for work on this resource and will offer to disable them. By clicking on OK you disable those proxies that are not suitable for using. This means that you need to set other proxies and repeat the same procedure. And if you are looking for proxies which will be 100% efficient, I recommend your reliable proxy service proxyseller.com. Personal proxies with 24-7 support are ideal for serious work and will provide anonymity at the proper level. If you still have questions, there is an article on proxyseller.com which can help you to configure goals browser step by step. I leave the link in the description. Subscribe to Proxy Seller channel and click like. There are many more helpful tips ahead which will make your job easier. Bye.